Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So this video is going to be um, a haul. Uh, so um, what I've like got, I've just done a haul from Superdrug. Um, it's like a shop in the UK that just basically does makeup and hair and all that shizal. Um, so yeah, let's dive straight in. So the first thing that I got was some just makeup wipes. It was on offer. Just Nivea micellar water, yeah, mm -hmm. bag of shit. The next thing that I got <clears throat> is my favourite primer. Let's see if it does it. Um, basically, this is um, a Nivea Express Hydration Primer. Um, I've used this one before, um, but I normally just use. I think it was for normal skin, so that's the one that I use. And then this is the new one. Um, and basically it's just like a gel kind of formula um, and it just glides on the skin and it just literally it's the perfect thing for your makeup it lasts all day and my skin usually it's smooth as a baby's ass so yeah um, this is a really good so it has um, what is it having it? almond oil and I'm not even going to try and pronounce that because I don't know absorbs instantly thanks to its light texture I agree and it, it just literally lasts all day it's so good so yeah another one that I got <clears throat> is the Revolution Pro Fix Oil Control Fixing Spray Revolution's I, I don't know if it's relatively new but it's actually a really good good decent brand and um, I've used some of the lotions not lotions setting sprays before Um I have been using the Barry M ones and they're alright but they're just so small I mean look at the size difference like and I do like a dewy finish nowadays I've, I've found that my skin is like really combination like it's dry here and just oily here um, so when I've set my face with like say a powder or something I do like to do like a dewiness um, but this is just the oil control one so it'll while I'm at work I can just spray it on and then it'll hopefully make it last. Another one that I got was the Aqua Priming Base. I don't know if you can see, my lighting's really bad. Um, but yeah, this one's just like spray it on your face. It is quite good pump. So it's gonna pow me in the face. I, um, I do really like my moisture. I think to have a nice base and even finish on your skin you've got to moisturize like it's essential <clears throat> another primer i got is um mua makeup academy skin divine hydro primer i've been after this for a while um let's see if it does it i have been using i do use the powder of this i can't find it at the minute um yeah i use like pressed powder of this um it's quite good um, and I think this was literally £1.25 or something um, and it's literally the weirdest gel formula ever like if I put my finger in it it leaves a fingerprint it's just so bizarre so I'm excited to try that and see if that works <clears throat> so my beauty blender is sadly departed from us so I thought I'd try a new one. I got the L'Oreal Infallible Foundation Blender. And I don't know if you can tell, but it's like really round and then it's got like a cut in it. Um, so I think that'll be really good to get in the eyes and then obviously bounce it around my face and stuff. Um, and hopefully, it's, it says it'll give me an airbrush finish, but whatever it does. I do love my beauty blenders. I never use a brush. I don't like to use a brush. I feel like if you use a brush, you get the streak marks and I can't be doing with that basically. <clears throat> Another thing I got is these Garnier Skin Active Moisture Bomb Masks. I live and die this stuff. I do use the um, Moisture Bomb Moisturizers. Um, the Marad or Die, like, I couldn't ask for a better moisturizer. They're so good. Um, and these are really good. I've used this one before. It, uh, this one's like really good and you only use it once and it's supposed to last for a week I think. I don't know but it looks good anyway. And then this one is supposed to 
mattify the skin, hydrate and make pores less ava available, what the fuck? It's got green tea extract, high hyaluronic acid and hydrating glycerin. So I might actually use this and then put makeup on to see how my skin goes. Another one, this is a highlighter, is the L'Oreal True Match one. I saw this and I just, I had to get it. Um, I'm obsessed with my highlighters, like everyone. I've got the Sleek one, that's a really good one. Um, I'll just do a swatch. Uh, yeah, the Sleek one's really, really nice and really pretty. Um, so I, I just swatched this in the shop and it was so pretty. Like, I don't know if you can tell. I don't think you can see. Come on, lighting. Can you see anything there? Sorry, my view. Oh, there we go. My viewfinder is real weird. But it's just really, I think it's just going to give a really nice glowy look. Not too harsh. I think after foundation, just putting it, I think it'll just give a really, really nice dewy look. Um, yeah, I'm going to try that out. And it's so cool. You get like a miniature brush, which I probably won't even use, but I might do. And then you get a little mirror. It's so cool. So yeah. Um, and lastly, I think anyway, I've heard really good things about this. It's another one from Revolution. It's the Pro HD Contouring Palette. I've heard so many good things about this. I don't normally contour on a daily basis. Um, and I have been, normally when I go out, I only um, contour to go out. And I do use the Barry M Chisel Cheeks one. Um, but I thought I might start doing it like for work and stuff. Just cheer myself up, but yeah. I got the fair one and it's a cream not a not a powder I don't like using powders because I feel like it brings out your texture and all stuff like that but oh uh, this highlighter there let's see if it this highlighter is like so nice oh look at that oh my dears I'm gonna be blinding the bitches from the gods so yeah that's the last one um, so yeah, that's literally my half home super drug. Excuse the face today because uh, I've had my brows done for my brow lady. My brow lady is, uh, she's amazing. My skin's horrendous. I wear makeup every day so I'm trying to give it a little break today. Just moisturiser all over the face. So yeah, I think I'm going to put a face mask on and yeah. So I might do a first impressions. It might go up. I don't know, um, but yeah, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, hopefully, and yeah, I'll see you in the next video.